everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Mr. Smitty. Um, today I'm going to be going through just a quick tutorial on how to download and utilize Screencast-O-Matic uh, to screen record on your computer so that way my students can actually go in and screen record themselves working through Google SketchUp for schools as they are building their 3D model chess set. So we'll move straight into the tutorial. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you navigate to your internet browser and I'm going to then go to screencastomatic.com. Alright, so screencastomatic.com. Um, so as of right now, um, for education purposes, they are offering a free web launcher that allows you to use Screencast-O-Matic for free. So if you go here and you click on record for free, so this blue button, then it'll bring you to the next page. On the next page, you've got to click the orange button that says launch free recorder. And then it will actually um, do a pop out to a download down here on the bottom right. I already have Screencast-O-Matic, so it's just going to ask me to open it. All right, so on your screen down here on the bottom left, you'll have a download that you'll need to click on and install. So I'm going to open Screencast-O-Matic. And I'll give you an idea of basically how it works and what it looks like. All right, so at this point on my screen, you can see that I have this black and white frame. So this black and white frame is going to be what is recorded. So if you don't want to have your browser bar at the top inside of your video, then you need to set your browser frame to be just the edges of your browser frame. All right. The next thing we want to look at is we can do just the screen, just the webcam, all right, screen or just the webcam, or we can do both. And down here in the bottom right, it'll add the webcam to your, so just so you can see, just so you can see, I have my normal webcam that I use for videos, but then there's also the Screencast-O-Matic webcam. All right, so webcam and webcam. So once you have all that set up, um, you do want to double check that your mic is working. So I can see that I have two green bars here, so it is picking up my mic. Um, you can set your resolution. Uh, I just need it to be as uh, clear as possible. So if you want to do um, whatever is native to your window, that would probably be best. But if your computer doesn't run that fast, then you might want to go to 720p because I'll still be able to see it, um, but it just won't be as clear. All right, so if your computer's not working well, do drop your size down to 720p. Other than that, all you have to do is click the record button here. It's going to give you a three, two, one, and now my screen is recording. So as we are working through our Google SketchUp for Schools, at this point you would be like, hello, my name is Mr. Smitty. And today I'm going to be showing you how you would 3D model a chess piece in Google SketchUp for Schools. Then you're going to navigate, open a new file, talk about dimensions, um, and then you'll actually go through and talk about the tools as you use them. You know, that's my expectation, and we're going to look at the rubrics and the project description in class. All right, so I just wanted to give a video representation of how to use Screencast-O-Matic. Um, so when you're done, you'll just click the pause button here. All right, click the pause button, then click done. It's going to ask you to save. All right, so now that we need to save it, um, this on the right side will pop up. You'll click save as. You'll tell it where to save, what to name it. Um, screencast o -matic example. All right. And then you'll click publish and then it'll save it for you. All right. So once you're finished, you're just going to go through and save the video. And then I'll give you instructions on how to upload the video in class. All right. Well, that's it for this presentation. As always, please like, subscribe, and share. And I will see you next time.